Koalas could vanish from the Sunshine Coast within 10 years. That's the grim warning from leading wildlife experts holding a do-or-die summit in Noosa. Tegan George was there. Best get a picture now. Koala. The days of spotting one in the wild on the Sunshine Coast could be numbered. The tipping point for extinction, the point beyond which it becomes inevitable, may have already been surpassed. Koalas are facing localised extinction. Loss of habitat is to blame, along with cars, wild dogs and disease. It's one of the most vulnerable populations of koalas in Australia. It's prompted the local council to call on some of Australia's leading koala experts to help pinpoint where money needs to be spent. More research is vital. We've got to go in and count koalas, catch koalas, do health assessments and do long-term monitoring. A study done in 2006 showed there was a healthy koala population here at Noosa National Park. But fast forward just six years, and now there's only a handful left. For some areas, it's already too late. I think some populations here we may have to give up on. Some populations we may be able to look at um, translocation. That's worked on the Gold Coast where $2 million has been spent over the past few years tracking and protecting the vulnerable species. On the Sunshine Coast, Tegan George, 10 News.